Hi everyone, I want to share with you how to write an easy chiptune style arpeggio which you can use in your song. So we'll be using silent one and open up the initial preset. I slide the polyphony up to 4 and put the volume to about 2.5. And we're gonna need one sine wave. I slide the attack just a little bit like this. Leave the decay and sustain and slide the release to about 2. Now we need one more sine wave, an octave higher. And decrease the volume to about 7. Slide the voices to 2. And next we need a high pass filter, 12 dB. Put the cutoff to about 30, to about 33 Hz. Put the lower cut of the one and press the warm drive function. Next we need some EQ. I put the bass to about 5. Put this to about 180. The travel function to 8 and the travel frequency to about, to about 2700. Let's increase the volume a little bit. Now this ba that's basically the sound. Now you can change it to make it different sounding. You can play with the drive function. You can play with the cutoff. You can even change the wave to a tri wave or a so wave. You can add some reverb. Reverb makes everything sound better. Now I'll show you how to write this arpeggio in the piano roll. So open up the piano roll like this. And go here to snap and select uh, 1 6 step. And we'll just write an E minor triad arpeggio. So the notes are E, G, B, and it just repeats, e.g. Now I'm using a group of 5 notes. You can use groups of 6 notes and of 4 notes. It'll still have that fast chiptune sound. I'll just copy it like this. We're just using arpeggios inside the scale of E minor. If you don't know what that means, I can make a video explaining some useful music theory for electronic music. So if you would like that, please tell me in the comments. Now let's change this to a to D major arpeggio. So D, F sharp and A. You can use 7 chords if you want, but I think this works best with regular triads. And let's add one more. Uh, C major for example. Now we'll add another one. Uh, it's a it's a B minor arpeggio, so B D and F sharp. We'll just make it a little bit different. Like this. And basically that's it, that's how you write a fast sounding chiptune style arpeggios. You can add some reverb if you like. Hope you learned something from this video. And if you liked the video please give it a like and leave a comment down below and tell me what you think. Also. There will be more synth tutorials, so make sure to stay tuned and hit that subscribe button.